Welcome, my name is Robert Kaiser, CEO of UK-based PPSS Body Armor and alongside our Swedish manufacturing partners we have developed what I believe one of the best bulletproof vests in the world. Uh, one of the thinnest, one of the lightest, one of the truly outstanding body armor right now on the market. With an exceptionally low weight of 1.65 kilogram and an exceptionally low thickness of 6 millimeter I think our body armor is one of the most user-friendly, wearable and comfortable body armor out there on the market right now. We have certified or tested and certified our bulletproof vest according to NIJ level 3A, according to standard NIJ uh, 01004. And we also have submitted our, our body armor for additional testing and additional protection against Takarov uh, 762 by 25 mm and Makarov 9 by 80 mm uh, in reference to our, or in favor really, of our Eastern European friends and clients around the world. Let me assure you, we have used the very best materials out there. There's no doubt about that. We have used uh, DSM Dyneema SP51. We have used Cordura 180 uh, for our cold for our uh, breathable and waterproof covers. And we've also used uh, temperature controlling Outlast space technology, and I can say it is, is as good as it gets at the moment from the manufacturing capabilities point of view uh, to take care of issues such as you know, body heat and body sweat, etc. etc. But I think what's very, very important, and I thought for sort of in reference to what's going on in today's society, it also offers unmatched protection from hypodermic needles such as this one. Um, I really feel that the risk of infection such as uh, HIV and hepatitis C is ever, ever so present. I think protecting our frontline professionals, such as uh, homeland security professionals and law enforcement officers, I think is absolutely crucial for any kind of modern body armor. So this body, this needle, you can see, I hope you can see it, uh, viewer, in front, and I held this needle in front of the body armor, and I tried to uh, penetrate the body armor. I won't even scratch the surface properly, to be honest. Um, that bends the needle, and I even break the needle. And this is exactly what you would like to expect from a high quality, top of the range, bulletproof vest. The following test is very important, excuse me, the following test is very important. Uh, we're gonna use a Glock uh, 19, the way I understand, a nine by 19 millimeter, uh, full metal jacket, one, two, four grain. And the following test is uh, important because it's, sort of, it's a reflection, almost like a copy of the test we have to pass in order to get to the certification. And it's uh, the test that be conducted, executed, and test houses all over the world. Uh, all body armor got tested and certified at the German Schutzamt Marystadt, my lovely uh, home country, Germany. And you will see that the blunt trauma is absolutely minor. Based on all my professional understanding, and I hope you trust me a little bit, I can assure you that the risk of a bullet actually penetrating bulletproof vest is very, very low. That is, of course, subject to the ammunition being used on the gun you're looking at at that moment. But in general terms, the risk of blunt trauma protection or the blunt, blunt trauma injuries is way superior to that. And it's our job from the manufacturing process to protect you, the potential wearer, from such an incident. And if I tell you that the blunt trauma liner or the trauma liner we have used is only 0.85 millimeter, it will almost blow, blow your mind. But it's, this is what technology and marketing capabilities or manufacturing capabilities have allowed us to do it now and in order to protect those people who protect and serve all over the world. So in order to sort of measure the blunt trauma impact that the world have, I will sort of hand this over to my colleague, uh, one of the world's most highly trained, highly skilled firearm experts. You will fire a shot all body armor, and then we can see the blunt trauma it will have created. Thanks. Now I would say right now, and it's only a good guess, but I mean, we, don't, we don't want to become uh, too scientific about all the whole issue. In general terms, I would say that's probably in the region of 10 to 15 millimeter. Now, will you get injured? Yes, you will. And uh, will you feel pain? You certainly will. And it will hurt a lot. But it's a matter of fact, 
that you will you will go home to your wives and children at the end of that. And that's what body armor is all about. It's not about you now eliminating the risk of injury. It's enabling you to stay safe. It's about improving your personal safety. And you are going home afterwards. You will walk away from that. With a bit of pain, with a bit of bruising, but you will survive. And this is what all body armor will do. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions in reference to Bodhyama, please don't hesitate to contact us at www.ppss-group.com and our guys will certainly be delighted to take care of you. All the best. Thank you.